Hey guys and welcome to Solar Cabin Channel. Uh, today I'm going to be reviewing a portable solar panel. This is a 120 watt solar panel made by Browie. And uh, I got the Browie uh, power station. I really like this unit. I've done reviews on it. Uh, I like it because it's small, easy to carry around, but still has enough power capacity uh, that this will run like one of my 12 volt fridges for uh, 20 hours. And I put it to the test in the video. So I really like this unit for like camping because it's portable, also has some really nice features, lights and things on it. Browie also produces solar panels uh, to recharge these units, which would be really good if you're going to be taking them camping. And this is kind of a universal solar panel uh, because it has connectors that will work on other units besides just the Browie power station. This should also work on any power station that can handle up to 120 watts in solar panel charging. So it should work with the Jackeries and the Generarchs or any of those other brands. Uh, and the panels are generally, from Browie, are more affordable, I will say that, uh, than if you buy it directly from the uh, power station manufacturer. So you may want to consider one of these. So I'm just going to do a quick review on this. We'll charge up the Browie, see how it works. And so what it has a pouch on the back side of it. And in the pouch, here's the instruction manual. Uh, it also gives you the, uh, the uh, spe specifics for the panel. panel. Uh, it says this is a 120 watt monocrystalline panel, uh, USB output. Now that's what I'm going to talk about here because this has actual direct USB ports. You can charge something like your cell phone or your laptop or your gadgets that use USB. You can charge them directly from this panel, something you can't do on a lot of panels. You can charge them directly from this panel uh, without even having it attached to the power station. So you can just set it outside and charge up your gadgets. And you can use it to charge power stations. So it has a USB output of uh, 5 volt 3.4 amp, 9 volt 2.5 amp, 12 volt 2 amp, uh, it has a type C output, that's your fast chargers, uh, for 5 volt, 3 amp, 9 volt, 3 amp, or 12 volt, 3 amp. It has a DC output of 18 volts, 6.67 uh, amps, and uh, it is a, a, a fairly compact and good, good looking panel. I opened it up to look at it. And inside the case, this is the uh, controller on the back of the case. It has, I'll try to show you this, it has a... Uh, two USB ports and a USB-C port down here, and then it has the plug for uh, powering something like your power station. It comes with the cord. It comes with the cord to, to plug into the uh, Bowery power station. We'll just take that out here and uh, keep your rubber band here, I guess, so you can save that. And then this is the cord, and it's got about a six-foot cord probably. Uh, that connects directly to the to the plug on this unit and then connects to the Browie power station and then it also has these adapters and you can see it's got one two three four five six seven eight nine it's got ten adapters uh, for different types of power stations so if you've got a power station that uses one of these types of plugs you can still use this uh, solar panel with those even if you don't have the Browie power station so that's really nice I like that feature because I have several power stations that use these types of plugs uh, that didn't come with solar panels so I can still use this solar panel with any of those power stations all right so we'll put that back in there because I don't need that right now and I don't need the instruction manual so close that up and then we'll unfold this out just to see what it looks like now it's got velcro on the back uh, it is using this uh, weatherproof material, so it should stand up to some uh, good use. And you can see it folded out. You can see it folded out how big it is. And this is 120 watts. So I'm going to set this up here in the sunshine. And we'll plug it into the Browery, and we'll see how well it charges up under the sunlight, which right now I've got kind of cloudy conditions, but the clouds will move over. We'll get some better sunlight. We'll see how long it takes to charge up this Browey unit. Okay, so here you can see I've got the Browey panel. 120 watt panel folded out. It does have feet on the back of it. You just unfold it and then you can set it up. I've just got it kind of set here so it's directly into the sunlight. And uh, you plug the cord in. It does have a locking connection. So when you plug the Browery cord in, it goes in and then locks so it won't pull out easy. And then it just connects to the uh, slot on the power controller or the power station. Uh, and it shows that it's putting out about 85 watts right now. We've got some sunlight, we've got some clouds kind of over, so we're not going to get the full 120 watts out of it. But 85 watts is pretty good, and that will charge this uh, unit up relatively fast. Probably about four or five hours, it'd probably charge it up completely. Uh, and, you know, that that's a panel that it's a good size. 
Uh, 120 watts is uh, about the maximum for these small units like this to charge up. Uh, but because it's portable, it folds right up uh, in a compact case and it has all the adapters. For a very reasonable price on Amazon, you might want to consider one of these Browie panels uh, to go with whatever power station you have, as long as one of the uh, as long as one of the adapters will work with it. Uh, maybe a really good deal, something for you to look at. That maybe if you've got a power station and didn't come with a solar panel, maybe you want to look at one of these Browie panels. I think it seems to be well made. Everything is stitched well. The material is an outdoor uh, material. These are monocrystalline panels, uh, so they will get the maximum amount out of the sunlight. And it seems to work really well. I like it because it's very compact, so I can take it with me camping. You could use this if you're tent camping and you just have a small power station. Maybe you want to run a CPAP machine. Maybe you're running a small 12-volt fridge or fans or lights or whatever it is around your campground. This would be a really good setup, these Browie units. All right, folks, I think it's good. I will put it to some more testing in the future let you know how it works out. Uh, but from what I see, it's good quality uh, at a very reasonable price on Amazon. All right, folks, have a great day.